here with Predator Motorsports. Wanted to give you kind of a final wrap up, a look at one of our very custom vehicles. We had a company come to us with very specific requirements as to what they wanted their H1 to look like, how they wanted it to function and overall work off-road. You can see Neptune Expedition was this company with a lot of these requirements. Starting first with the brush guard. Custom design from our regular D-ring brush guard and even our HD brush guard just to fit the lights that he want. A very lightweight brush guard but still very effective in uh, getting some of the stuff that would you know, come and hit the vehicle from the front out of the way. Also, you can see up top with our search and rescue roof rack, what we've done here is we've gotten a uh, custom light bar extension built off the front of that roof rack with antenna mounts, with uh, remote control lights, with a communication satellite system, and then obviously all the lights to go with it. And then also alongside here, all the different Vision X lights. That, uh, that the customer wanted in order to see, basically do a 360 degree uh, light up with this vehicle. It's pretty cool. As we come back to the seat. Another key component to this custom build is in the search and rescue rear bumper. As you can see, it's uh, one of our standard rear bumpers. It's got the ladder system, it's got the light bar, it's got the jerry can carrier and the tire carrier here. But what we've also done is we've taken that bumper, we've integrated a 16.5 worn winch, right in here. It's popped this out a little bit, a little bit more of a bulky look to it, but no doubt puts that 16.5 winch in here just like it does on our standard bumper. We've also gone and we've uh, created some custom steps right here, real solid steps. You can get your foot on there and climb up to the top of the truck no problem rather than having to reach all the way up to the top of the bumper. We've also integrated some high lift jack points right here. So if you do get stuck, your high lift jack will fit in right here and you'll be able to elevate the rear of your truck with safety and um, not have to worry about finding something on the truck as to damage the actual body of the truck or the bumper, but you've got that nice bolt on point right there. So um, among that, you know, we've got a lot of other upgrades on this truck, but at the end of the day, what we've done is we've taken these customer requirements, we've built it into the truck and created something that fits their specific requirements, much like we could do for you in any build that you have. Here we are on the inside of the blue Neptune Expedition Hummer and we wanted to highlight some of the upgrades we've done in here. Here at Predator we pride ourselves on search and rescue roof racks, deering brush guards, search and rescue rock rails, rear bumpers. We also do a lot of great performance upgrades, conversions, you know, intakes, computers. But what we wanted to really focus on right now is the inside upgrades that we do. As you can see on this Hummer, there was very specific requirements that the customer came to us and wanted us to execute. First of all, starting over here with an interior mounted camera and display. Very custom for the, for the navigator in this truck to be able to see what's going on outside and also get a full record of what's going on outside after the expedition's done. As you go from there, you can see that we've done a custom laptop mount right here, right where the center console normally is. And then we've also done custom gauge pods, reading out all the same information that the driver seeing. So both the driver and the navigator can be fully up to date on what's happening with the engine, what's happening with CTIS, uh, fuel levels, everything like that is fully read right here. And then you'll see the gauges up here as well. Moving on down here for the rear, we've done a fully integrated satellite phone system with plugins. And so you can be fully connected anywhere you are in the world. Some additional things that we've done with this build are Momo steering wheel. We've done custom seat covers, very supple leather, very tough, very durable, um, very comfortable to sit in. And we've also covered the dash in the same leather. And then moving up here to the overhead console, completely redesigned the factory overhead console to integrate both screens, uh, radio, a screen over there on the passenger side, and then finish it off with a uh, Alcantara suede leather for a very clean, uh, very nice finish. And so, um, yeah, it was a great build. A lot of work went into this truck, but um, at the end of the day, you get a very nice finished product, something that you can be proud of.